Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Back with another favorites video because it is the end of September. What happened to September? I have no idea. I thought it was gonna be like a long month, but no, it's September 23rd today and it's the last Friday. Well, today's not Friday, but I'm uploading this on the last Friday in September. So I was like, dang, gotta do a favorites video. Um, so let's get to it. I have four categories today. I will list them here. I have fashion, tech, food, and other. Um, no like really diabetes things today, but that's okay. Life isn't all about diabetes. Although honestly, if you have it, it is. But again, not what this video is about. So here we go. Okay, I'm gonna start with fashion. So I, made some interesting fashion purchases this month. If you don't know me, which none of you really do, this is YouTube, um, I hate carrying like a purse around. I just like, it drives me insane. My one shoulder gets sore and it's just like, ugh, my hands are like doing stuff with it. So I usually carry a backpack around. Now I've been looking for a really cute backpack that was like a little bigger than the one that I was using before. Um, side note, the backpack I was using before was like, also a diaper bag, but I did not have children. It was cute for that, but, and it had a lot of pockets in it. Um, so anyway, so I was kind of outgrowing that one. So I was like, I need a new backpack. So I went on Amazon. First I went to Target and I searched high and low for a really cute backpack and I just couldn't find one that I was completely satisfied with. Then I was like, go on Amazon, Sarah. Duh, like you will find one that you love. Um, and I did. I found whoop, this backpack. It's so cute. It has side pockets, a little front pocket, which is actually where I put my pen and I keep like chapstick and it's where I keep my pen, a writing pen and my insulin pen. Um, it has a strap that if you want to just like oh, throw it over the shoulder, you can. And the best part about it is the zipper. So it's a backpack. The zipper is in the back. It unzips the whole way, but it's kind of like anti-theft in the back, which is really cool. Um, so I know like none of my stuff will hopefully get stolen. Knock on wood, I'm gonna knock on wood. Um, but yeah, so I have like low snacks in here, pen caps, and there's like so much room for more. You can't even, even like see it, but it's in there. Um, I love the side pockets. It makes it so easy to like one, throw a little hand sanitizer in there because hello, coronavirus. Two, throw your keys in there. I always find that I am shoving my keys in my pockets. Like I don't want to put them all the way in my backpack and I don't want to put them in my pockets, but I also don't want to hold them. But now I can just shove them in a side pocket and these are like pretty deep. So they're not gonna like fall out. Um, again, knock on wood, cause that has crossed my mind before. So I got this backpack, I love it. You can fit so much in it. Um, I use an iPad Pro and you can honestly, iPad Pro 12.9 inch, cause, cause that's important for um, size and purposes, but it fits in here, like really great. So. I love this and you can tell I love this because I also bought it in black. Once that one arrived, I was like, oh my God, bag of my dreams. So I bought it in black too. I'm obviously not using this cause um, I'm gonna use this more in the winter. I definitely use black bags in the winter and brown all other times of the year. But that's my first thing on my fashion list is that amazing backpack. I got it on Amazon. It will be linked below. The rest of my stuff is, not gonna lie, it's from Airy. If y'all have seen any of my favorites videos before, you'll know Airy often comes up. So, to start, I have seen people wearing these shirts. They're the Henley tees. Let me make sure I'm holding it up the right way. It's just like a super loose, I'm gonna talk while I hold it in front of me, super loose, comfy, ribbed, uh, like shirt, long sleeve shirt. Um, it's flowy. I just washed this so it's still like in shambles, but there's thumb holes for your thumb. Super flowy, super comfy, perfect for like fall weather, um, which we are having now, hence long sleeves. 
Ugh. It was like literally in the 30s earlier this week. And my apartment, one morning I woke up and it was 64 degrees. So I was freezing. Anyway, great for fall weather. You could pair it with, you know, like jeans or shorts or whatever. It has buttons in the front so you can button it all the way up or you can, you know, unbutton it like so. <laughs> Love this. I have it in another color um, and I'm honestly like, should I get it in more colors? Let's be real, no, because I have clothing, I don't need more. But let's be, let's live in our dreamland uh, where, yeah, I should definitely get more colors. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. I do have it in one other color though, and that is like a mustard yellow, which is so cute. I think they call it heirloom. I literally love it. Oh my God, okay. Anyway, moving on. Another long sleeve shirt, which I honestly never thought I would buy in this color, but I'm here for it is the desert sweatshirt. So this, again, super flowy, super comfy. Um, it's this really nice like towel material. And honestly, these were called like beach fleeces last year and they were sold in like spring and I bought like every color cause I love them. They're like sweatshirt, but not sweatshirt. And they changed the style a little bit, but same material from the beach fleeces last year. But now it has this really nice like slit here so you can wear it with leggings and it flows a little better. I honestly love the slit. It is long, so if you, I'm short, so everything is long on me, but like if you're taller, this would be really perfect. Um, and again, I bought it in this loco color cause I was like, I don't have any yellow. I have mustard, but no like bright yellow. And I actually really like it. I like it more than I thought I would. So desert sweatshirt will be linked below, also from Aerie. I do think this is on sale right now, so if you like this, you should get it, cause we love sales. I'm hoping when they come out with like new arrivals, which hopefully will be happening soon, that they have more colors of these, cause this I definitely will buy, cause, because. Last thing on my fashion list, which honestly my favorite one, and there's a bit of a story behind it, also from American Eagle, from Aerie, is this. Oversized jean jacket, which I don't even know how to like show you, but it's distressed. It's super cute. Um, it has all types of like rips in it, one on the shoulder. It is like perfectly oversized, perfectly like just long and looks so good with leggings and you could put long sleeves. I had the other day, I had a desert sweatshirt underneath it and I was like still had room, which I was like, okay. That's impressive. This jean jacket is amazing. It's a little expensive. It is like $80, um, but my funny story that goes along with it, which I will tell right now very quickly. So I ordered this and it was like 30% off because I think I ordered it on Labor Day weekend. And then I was like, okay, cool. 30% off came down to like $50. Um, I have an American Eagle credit card because obviously I love them. Uh, so I got like extra 10% off. So it came down to like $52. I was like, yeah, okay, cool. I can do with that. Like $50 is still kind of expensive, but the reviews are really good. So I was like, okay, I'll just do it. So I got it in the mail and I actually got a pair of extra small bikini bottoms and not this coat. And I was like, oh crap, this is not the jacket. I had to message American Eagle Airy and get a refund. And then they refunded me obviously cause they sent the wrong item. And they also sent a 20% off coupon code, which the jacket was still in stock. It was still 30% off. So I used a 30% off coupon with a 20% off coupon with my 10%. And this came down to $42. I was like, wow, I'm actually so glad I got the wrong item in the mail because now it just got cheaper. And then obviously the right one showed up and all was good and happy in life again. This denim jacket from Airy will be linked below. My next category, so that's it for fashion. My next category is tech. Um, I went out on a limb this month and I found myself buying a new gadget. Um, one that I kind of had already, what, but not really. So I had a Nintendo Switch Lite. I bought that cause I was like, it was cheaper than the console. And at the time I was like, this is all I want and I can play my games on it and everything is great. Um, and then I just found myself thinking, I really wish I had a console. I wish I could hook it up to my TV. That would be so nice. You can play different games on it that you can play on the light. So I found myself randomly looking at Target one night and I saw that they had a console. And I was like, oh, oh my God, 
blush. I was like, that's one I've been wanting and like I should just buy it and then I can figure out what to do with my light later. I wasn't planning on buying a console. I wasn't, I did not search high and low. I know these are so hard to find. So I saw it and I was like, okay, gotta grab it. So I grabbed it, picked it up the next day and I was very happy. Um, So this is definitely on my favorites list. Um, It's definitely worth the money. I did end up selling my Switch Lite um, on Facebook Marketplace, which I've never done before. I was very proud of myself. Um, so I got that, which kind of went towards this since it is like $300. I'll try and link this below. I saw they had some on Amazon, but I don't know if they have them at Target anymore. Maybe I'll link Target and Amazon. So it's just like two links that if you are looking for a Nintendo Switch console that you can find it. Honestly, if you can find the light, the light is definitely worth it. Um, but I was happy with the console. I love that I can play it on my TV now. I can just like lay back on the couch and play Animal Crossing on my television, which is behind you. So I had some games for it, which I won't um, put in this video because I didn't buy them in September. But a game that I did buy from Target was Mario Odyssey and oh my gosh, I didn't think I could love a game so much, but I love this game. It's pretty hard, and that's what I like about it, is I find that it uses my brain. Um, so I am not just like sitting here aimlessly playing like Animal Crossing or like what something else. But you have to use your brain to get all the moons in this game. So Super Mario Odyssey, definitely recommend. I think you can play it. This might be one of the games that you can only play on the Switch console. Cause you have to use the joysticks to like, I didn't use that word, right? You have to like fling stuff around, uh, which you can't do on the light. But if you have a console and you don't have Mario Odyssey, I highly suggest that you should buy it. It's amazing. Next on my list, which I don't have a physical copy of this because I downloaded it, another Switch game is Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Pretty sure I said that right. Um, so I'll put a picture of it here. It's like three games in one. And the main reason I bought this was because of Super Mario 64, which I used to play all the time on my N64. I just, it's like nostalgia playing it. It's so fun. You have to find all the stars and it's all like the graphics look the same, which is kind of funny because it's like a 90s game, but now we're playing it in 2020. Um, but they also have Super Mario Sunshine, which I never played, but I'm starting to now that I like have it in that game, in that little bundle. And also Super Mario Galaxy, which I've never played before. And I probably will eventually, but still trying to be Odyssey, still, trying to beat Super Mario 64. I get so frustrated with that game that I have to like quit and play Animal Crossing or do something else because I just will sit here and like aimlessly just try and win and I don't and then I die like a hundred times and it just, it just doesn't work out. That is another one on my list of tech. And I think that's it for tech. Two games and Switch console. Amazing. Highly recommend. Especially because we're going into winter and with quarantining and who knows what's gonna happen. I recommend a Switch if you're debating on getting one. Plus it's fun, you can play Mario Kart with your friends. It's really, is a grand time all around. Two more categories. I would say we're, we're more than halfway through this video at this point, but halfway through the categories. on um, The categories of food. I did this in my last uh, favorites video. One thing that I found when I started taking Trulicity, uh, which if you don't know what that is, you can find it in my last two, three videos I think I did, they were all on Trulicity. On Trulicity, I found it so hard to keep hydrated. So like, I just, I feel like I drink water all day, but like, I'm not getting hydrated at all. So um, I had seen these and I tried them before. It was kind of like, eh, whatever, but they're noisy. Liquid IV, liquid IV. Um, it is like this electrolyte stuff you can put in your drink. It's kind of salty, which helps you retain water. Not a doctor, so I'm not sure if that's factually correct, but that's what we're gonna say. So these help you retain water. They actually just came out with like two new flavors. Um, well, the flavors I have here are lemon, lemon lime, and passion fruit, my two favorites. I've tried a Kai berry, but I don't love that one. I did just see, I think like yesterday or this weekend, they came out with watermelon, something else, and apple pie, which just sounds interesting. I'm not sure in a good way, um, but they came out with some new flavors of these. Um, essentially, they're like an electrolyte mix. That's what it literally says. Non-GMO electrolyte drink mix, hydration multiplier, and these work. Like, I actually am hydrated. Like, it just, 
it's amazing. Um, they do have a little carbs in them, so I try and eat like maybe one or two a day because you have to take insulin for them and like that's kind of annoying. They only have like 11 carbs, but these are amazing if you have trouble staying hydrated. Will be linked below. Got them on Amazon and at Costco, but we'll link on Amazon below. And I'll update you guys later if I try apple freaking pie or whatever it's called. That just sounds like a weird thing to put in a drink. Right? Like, why would you want to drink apple pie flavored water? Moving on to other, which this kind of goes with food. It's a kitchen item. No, maybe it's not. A stasher bag. So I think this is the half gallon stasher bag. It's not the stand up one, which I have some of those, but I just got the half gallon, like non stand up ones. Cause I honestly, I was like, I'm not sure what I'm going to use this for. Um, but I think it'd be good to have just to have it. And I actually have found that I use it a lot. What I mainly use it for is defrosting chicken, straight up. So I put the chicken in here cause like sometimes the bags have like little holes in them cause I freeze my chicken. Um, and while they're defrosting in my fridge, they're in here, all the chickeny water stuff. Ugh stays in here and it's all good. Um, if you don't know what Stasher is, they're a really great company that make reusable like silicone Ziploc bags. They have a ton of different sizes. Um, you probably saw me pull one out of my um, backpack earlier that had my pen caps in them. They have like little mini ones that are like this big. They have sit, uh, they have sandwich size and they have like long snack bags. They have stand up ones, which I have a couple of those. I love using those to marinate stuff in. They also have mega, mega stand up bags and mini and then like normal size, which I only have the normal size. I don't know what I would use the mega or the mini for, but maybe, maybe once I see them in person, I'll come up with a scheming idea to use them and then I'll have to buy them. But stasher bags are amazing. They help the environment and you can wash them in the dishwasher. So this one is the amethyst color. They have a bunch of, I feel like I'm really jumping around. They have a bunch of different colors as well. They have like jewel tones and colors from the ocean, i.e. blue. It's just, it's a really cool company and I really, I really like them. That's it for this video. Um, I thought this was gonna be short, but now I'm wondering if it's gonna be kinda long. Um, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, hit the notification bell. I will see you guys next week with a new video and it will be October then. What? 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 Like goodbye September. Wake me up when September ends. It's over, news flash. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for dealing with my crazy antics. It's always appreciated. Um, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.